Welcome, welcome, welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Well, I love. Who are we on? My Pisces? Who are we on? Ooh, my fishes. My fishes. My fishes. My fishes. Ah. Okay, how many pens do I need on one spot? All right. Let's see what's going on with my Pisces. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Get a grip. Get a grip, Pisces. <laughs> Get a grip. Oh, you're distracted. You are distracted. I'm so distracted. Okay. I mean, I just said you were distracted, and my daughter's boyfriend, who's 21, mind you, her boyfriend just walked out of the bedroom with his boxers on, wearing Santa Claus boxers. Yep, that just happened. Okay, and there's that. Figured I'd share that with you. Fun, right? Any who's you guys are distracted. Like, you guys got me all over the place. I should have saved you for last. <laughs> sorry, not sorry. This happened the other day, actually. Damn. All right, we're just going to have to go with that. What's going on with my Pisces? Yep. Some of you have clearly been enlightened. Um, your forehead's driving you nuts, but it's your third eye. And it's frustrating. Um, it's almost like every time, in order for you to control it, what you're doing is you're putting your finger on your forehead. You're putting your finger on your third eye, so it so it stops the whole. It stops the whole. Um, I was gonna say magnitude of something. I don't know what that's all about, but you're stopping the the feeling, and it stops. It works, but you're stopping it. Um, It's like that tingling. Okay. Um, so we have the seven of fire and the four of air. All right. So you're defending your beliefs. You're standing up for your decisions. You're definitely standing your ground. It's one of those situations where you're choosing your battles wisely. But you, you need to rest. All right. Um, like I said, like I'm very scrambled energy. You need to take a legitimately a step back for a sec. Okay. Um, the six of air, some of you literally need to, gosh, everybody's getting this, but it's time to move forward. You got the tool of water. I don't know if this, you have some type of connection with the nine of earth. I don't know if your confidence is there yet. I don't know what this is all about, <clears throat> but you're either in a relationship or you just started one, but it's about to grow closer and deeper and it calls for forgiveness. Okay. Um, it, it's going to be a positive outcome to whatever this conflict is. So, some of you are definitely having trouble getting to this connection. Um, you're drowning. You're, you're all over the place. It's chaos. It's, I don't know what I want, you know, but you have a connection with somebody. Um, so, like I said, you guys just started one or you're about to start one. I mean, shit, my daughter's boyfriend just, you know, it's three, three, three. My daughter's boyfriend literally just walked out of the bedroom with the boxes on, okay? I know it's hot in there, and they're, they're always like that, so I'm not saying anything just went down. I don't even want to think about it, but I'm just saying, like, that's what I'm saying. Like, it's that type of connect. You're obviously sleeping with this person, or you've slept with this person. It, it's, it's that simple. Can you feel the beat within my hat? Somebody woke you up, okay? But you're standing your ground here. You, you need to rest. You're driving yourself apeshit. Take a vacation. Meditate. It m might provide answers that you're seeking. But the universe is also saying to you right now, choose your battles. Like, you're kind of being picky. Choose your battles. Okay. Um, so, let's see what's going on. Put my fishies. Got, I got a whole bunch of different groups of you. I hope I'm hitting a majority of you because it's all over the place. I really feel mul multiple scenarios. So it's not just one aspect of your life right now. I mean, it's it's a lot. And it just came to me, the last one, you had some type of um, feminine energy in your presence. Um, or it's, it's your energy, but it's dominant. Pisces, Pisces. 
the best advice I can give you that I clearly see out of all of this is it's time to rest. It, it's it, take, a, take a break. If you need to go towards somebody, go towards that person and take a break with them. Take a vacation with them. It's something like that. I just got the goosebumps, okay? So we got the Nine of Cups. So someone makes you happy. Um, and then we got the, the Ten of Wands. But you carry a lot of weight with this. So it, it's weighing on you. And again, it's it's the feminine energy that's here. You know, all these are feminine too. But like, can you feel the beat within my heart? It's something. Whatever this is, no matter how much weight is attached to it, it still has an amazing outcome. It just does. It's time to move forward. And it's just all at 555. Five, five. Um, you guys, this crown chakra, my head's itching. When it feels like you've got bugs crawling all over your head, it's your crown chakra. It's opening. So you're dealing with your third eye and your crown chakra. Whoa. Whoa. You're definitely being enlightened. You got the seven of cups. So it's deciding what direction you want to go. And you're dealing with, I don't even know if this is, I don't know if this is you or this other person. But it is prominent. Somebody is going, 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 going. Predicting. I think this energy is opening your chakras, to be honest with you. Even though this talks about options and choices, I, I think this energy is opening you. So you're either doing it yourself or this other person that you're connected with. Woo-wee. I don't think they're intentionally all up in your energy. I just think this person does it for you. You have a spiritual connection with somebody. Unless this is your spiritual connection with the divine, but I'm I honestly I'm feeling it way differently. For some of you, this is the other energy. This is the first time this has happened to me in all my raw loves this week. And I normally pick up on it like that anyway, but this all the other ones will have been about those zodiacs. This is this is your energy too. But this this other energy, she or he, but it's a she, she's the one that opens you. be a pence it's it's someone seeds have been planted but you're the male energy is considering planting seeds new seeds a new collaboration new teamwork something that's got potential something is bringing you back to life that's what all the chaos is your chakras are being opened and here we go with that choice. It's that balance, getting that balance between the dark and the light, the yin and the yang. So it's like, it's it's like, whoa, it's this person. Look how deep this is, guys. I, I can't even like, look at the circle around him. And then the circle around her. This is the fool taking a new start. All right, balancing the energies. You guys are so connected. You open each other's chakras. You probably talk telepath uh, telepathically. Yes, telepathically. I don't know what was trying to come out before. But these colors, look at this. This is like two peas in a pod. You met your match. Some of you legitimately met your match. T what is that? Oh, I just actually figured out. I think I know what that is. The divine's going to want you to come together and work on things. I just had an epiphany. That noise that I've always been making, I just figured it out. But it's me. It's personal. So it's no big deal. But that's, it's an epiphany. I just had one within your reading. Congratulations to Courtney. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> but, um, holy crap. The chaos. Chill out. Okay. Um, you're about to have a new start. This, the comment's about to be balanced. Again, it's the yin and the yang. Okay. And... That's it. You guys are woken each other. It's not about options. It's about moving forward. 
it, it truly is about moving forward. All right. There's been a death and a rebirth. It's a, that whole awakening I told you you were going through. You got hit with it. There's that ten of pens. You got something solid coming at you. Um, craziness. Crazy, crazy energy. You got a little squirrel in this card, which is awesome sauce. Um, somebody has a lotus pendant, a lotus tattoo, a lotus anything. Um, straight up lotus. You're rocking a lotus. Um, for those who don't know what that is, it's, it's a flower. Okay. Um, and there's all different types of them. I have like a lotus crystal here. There's a whole bunch of different types. And to be honest with you, I actually have a lotus tattoo. I just thought about that. Um, and there's a couple lotuses on them. Let me see. There's, nope, just two. I had to see if there was more. I have two of them on me. Um, but that's, that's a thing. Okay, so you got the emperor with the six of wands. This can be victorious, but right now you're holding yourself back. You're, you're trying to control. You're trying to put something, leave something in your control right now. You're trying to control the situation with this feminine energy. I don't know why you just, ah, stop fighting it is, is literally the message I'm getting. Stop fighting it. Plant your roots. <clears throat> you're curious. You're curious. It's time to go on a quest. Your, this paranormal this paranormal activity, which is spirituality, okay? Yeah, it's not ghosts and all this other stuff. Some of you experience ghosts, but not when I see it like this. This is a spiritual, this is an awakening. You guys activate each other. That's it. You activate each other. You do need to balance out the skills. You do need to ground this situation and move forward. Okay, it could be saying too, you know... It, it's they're telling you it's going to be victorious, but it's telling me you need to move forward. Go towards it. You need to be the leader here. You need to take action, which makes sense. You have the six of air. So yeah, that makes complete sense. You're the one that needs to go towards this, this person and being the six of wands, this person might actually be in the spotlight, but you need to go towards it. Okay. Um, I need you more and more. I need you more and more. Take me. Okay. So. You're my dream so sweet. This song says a lot. Okay. A place for me and you. Go we'll take a vacation. Go we'll make your own dreams a reality. Some of you like a dream. It, it is. It is. You did meet your match. And that's it. All right. You're holding on to somebody. They're holding on to you. It's not together, though. But um, go after it. Go after it. You're curious. Approach it. You know, don't let curiosity don't let curiosity kill the cat in this situation. Okay. Um when you can find somebody who has that spiritual click with you, it's awesome sauce. It's awesome sauce. And within the next two weeks, you guys for sure Z's are going to have an epiphany. Congratulations. I love it, you guys. Bye.